Gus favourite ahead of three. Not much between these two. Ben Rawlings has the pair of them, so likelihood of him getting the winner is, is very likely, according to the market. 2.20 each of two now. They've crunched Wilbur Beast late here. 2.60 into 2.20. Set to run. Race 10, Gawler. They're ready. Set and away. Now, Wilbur Beast was a little bit slow there. In fact, Almighty Chaos was a little bit slow. Wilbur Beast came out running and found the lead eventually and kicked away. A length and a half on El Rose in second. Back in third was Indian Light. Fourth placing there was Kansas Bale making ground. Then Zulu Hercules. Well back, Silverband falls and Almighty Chaos. Surely something amiss, but Wilbur Beast turned clear. It's three lengths on Indian Light and Wilbur Beast back with a win today. Second placing Indian Light. Kansas Bale third. Fourth placing Zulu Hercules. Then El Rose, Aston Odious, the rail. Well back with Silverband Falls. And the other favourite, Almighty Chaos, something surely amiss. Tailed off last of all. Wilbur Beast eventually wins. Number three, 250 on the, uh, 220 on the Ubet tote. And has um, came away to win after a sluggish beginning. Mustered up and took the lead down the back. Has raced away to win. 220 on the Ubet tote. Ben Rawlings prepares. His second run back in SA. And it was around 270 with about five minutes of betting to go. Smashed into 220 on the fix and has raced away to win. He'll be only better for that run. And I'm sure Benny will uh, contemplate a, a crack at the Gawler Cup heats now with him. 2270 the time. 3278 confirmed. The other favourite, Almighty Chaos. Well, there has.